Alright, what's up YouTubers, welcome to another Minecraft installation video. In this video I'm going to be installing the voxel map, or you can call it Zen's Minimap 2. Uh, right now I'm going to make a new profile, just load it up with version 1.11.2 installed. Uh, yeah, while that's happening we can download the files we'll need. So, voxel map uses... Uh, light loader instead of minecraft forge but i think it can be installed with minecraft forge too i'm not quite sure but for now i'm just gonna use light loader since it's easier to use um all right so there's two things you'll need to download the first one is this voxel map the mod file so just press this download file button and there you go then there's another one which is the light loader version which is 1.11.2 so we'll just click and download it from right here the easiest way to install your uh, light loader is with uh, um, the installer right here it's for windows in my case so there we go the light loader installer it's just the .x file which is very easy to use you'll see in a bit uh, for now I'm just gonna drag them to my desktop for easy access and as you see I've closed my minecraft and if I click the light loader installer right now we can go ahead and install light loader for the uh, desired version of Minecraft, which in this case is 1.11.2. Um, yeah, so we'll just go ahead and make it the uh, yeah the default name, the light loader 1.11.2 is the profile name you're going to be using to use the mod. So just press OK and you should be good to go. As you see it says successfully created new profile light loader 1.11.2 for version 1.11.2 into launcher. Alright so the first thing we're gonna do is just load up the launcher and see if it still works. Uh, yeah make sure you could you uh, select the new profile as you see it's right here. So far so good hit the play button and let it load up. Alright, so it seems to be working. Let's try and see if the mod installation can be done right away. So go to your search bar in Windows and uh, type the uh, percent sign app data percent sign, and you will see this uh, folder named uh, yeah as as I said percent set data percent sign app data percent sign. Or it says roaming. Um, you'll get in your roaming folder either way, so that's good. Uh, yeah, open up the first folder which says dot Minecraft, and there you have it, the folder named mods. Yeah, so this is the folder just created by uh, by Light Loader, and drag your voxel map right here. You can close this now, open up your Minecraft, and you should be good to go. When Minecraft is started up, I'll just load it up in uh, full screen. Yeah, so I'm uh, gonna make a new world now. Let's just put it to creative. Uh, create new world, let's just see if it all worked. I think it did. Yeah, so there we go. Uh, the minimap in 1.11.2 you can hit M for the total map uh, you can hit B I guess for quick waypoints no it's not working anymore yeah so maybe they've changed a bit of the controls we can actually just have a quick look um, let's see I think the controls should be right here yeah minimap controls so there we go, waypoint hotkey, they changed it to N instead of B, which it used to be waypoint menu. Alright, so if you wanna 
if you want to get shortcuts for the toggling of mobs or uh, the waypoint menu you will have to make them manually since they are not here uh, yeah by default so the waypoint hotkey is and let's just try it out and as we see nothing has changed really much there we can go ahead and create a quick waypoint uh, called test yeah so that's still working just fine and if you look at the minimap in the top right corner I think we can yeah so you can see the the waypoints on there and if I move further away it will show a little arrow to where it is if you look at the top right corner so yeah that's pretty much it it's very easy to install um, it should be compatible with other mods for Minecraft, Minecraft Forge but if it's not working for you you can just leave a comment and I'll make another video so good luck and if it worked for you please like and subscribe and comment for what you'd like to see uh, next it can be different things it doesn't have to be uh, mod installation tutorials thanks for watching